So for Christmas presents this year, I'm going to be filming it in like a grocery haul style. Um, I'm not going to get behind the camera and make a big production out of it. It's easier for me to just stand here and show you what I got and talk about it and move on. I'm going to be showing you during this video. I'm sure it'll be labeled, uh, titled. I'm going to do Andrew stuff, then uh, couples gifts, and then the stuff to Christina as well, just because Andrew is not getting that much. Um, uh, as far as items, he's getting a lot as far as money, monetary, uh, that was spent, but just not items. So you'll see what I mean in a minute here. So we got him 20, uh, one of these drink packets. These are the wild strawberry, great value. He loves them. Uh, it's 21 boxes. So every little bit helps. There's 10 packages, 10 sticks in each box. Then we got him some ornaments that he, he probably won't care anything about any of these ornaments, but they were all on sale. I can tell you that right now they were on sale. Uh, this is the Ghostbusters, Dr. Peter Vinkman. This is a, it's called a Waiting for a Nibble, which he will not care anything about. And this is a Honda motorcycle, which he probably won't care anything about. But when Kevin and I were young and we were first um, getting stuff for our tree, we put anything on our tree. It didn't matter if it had meaning to us or not. We just wanted to fill in the tree. So I'm hoping that he'll he'll use these. Uh, but then we found him this lighter. This is actually a cigarette lighter. The reason we got it is just because it's a novelty. And everybody can use a um, cigarette lighter to light the grill, light fireworks, 4th of July. And I'll probably just put it in the same box as the ornaments. Then we got him two sweaters. We bought him this Izod sweater and this Crofton Barrow sweater. This is, uh, these are both from Kohl's. This is the kind that Kevin really likes, the kind that uh, zips. Um, he likes those. But the reason Andrew doesn't have a lot of packages is because this is what Andrew's big gift is. This is an Xbox Series X. It was $499.99, so a $500 gift. You know, when you request a $500 gift, you don't get a lot of other gifts. But he will have gifts to open, couples gifts to open uh, for him and Christina both. So and there's always that. And then for Onyx, their dog, uh, we bought him these two items at Jungle Gems. We don't always give the dog something, but this time we, we saw, Kevin saw somebody walking out of Jungle Gems with this big rope and he said oh onyx would love that so we got onyx the big rope and then or the big bone is what he saw too then he saw the big bone as well and said onyx would love that so we got those for him so i will be right back to show you the gifts we got for them as a couple so there were only two couples gifts for them this is a, a, a scrabble uh, it's a deluxe two-in-one wall edition. So it um, has oversized magnetic, magnetic wood tiles. It says it's a fun and functional message board. And you know what? I never thought of it until now. Uh, Christina homeschools. She could absolutely utilize this for homeschool because, you know, because you do get the oversized magnetic tiles. She could... Uh, teach them spelling words and everything teach the kids on this so i thought that was really really cool um kevin and i would probably if it was ours and we hung it on the wall we would probably put like some kind of cryptic messages to each other on there or put our names on there or something like that um and then i also got on this this is really more for christina than andrew but i think he'll appreciate it too um you could use this in many rooms of the house so you could put um fruits in it definitely uh you could put uh, put it in the bathroom and put your uh washcloths or or lotions or uh shampoos whatever in it there's just there's all kinds of uses for this you could fill it with sidewalk chalk or you know just whatever you want to so now i'll show you christina's gifts so for Christina, um, I bought her a couple of table runners. I'm sure we bought them when they were on sale. This says celebrate Valentine's Day together. And it is a really cute table runner with a little banner at the bottom. And then this one is a St. Nicholas Square table runner. And I love that. 
and then I bought her some hand towels. So uh, she, there's two hand towels here and she could put one. Um, they actually have, I guess, three bathrooms at their house, but she'll, she'll have two new hand towels, <laughs> one for two bathrooms anyway, uh, for those. And then I, we bought her a couple of ornaments as well. Uh, this is called Festively fes uh, Flexible. And this is Santa doing yoga, which I think is hilarious. And then we bought her these Lauren Conrad ornaments. And there's a flamingo and a pineapple and a um, watermelon uh, piece. Just very um, whimsical, I think. And then I bought her this uh, Peck Sniffs. This is a lavender and white tea. It's made in England, and you open it up, and it's a gift set. So you get uh, two candles, uh, there's a body scrub, there's hand lotion, shower gel, moisturizing hand lotion. So just a really nice gift set. And then I got her a bunch of these gift sets. I got her a, uh, this is called Body Prescriptions Warm Cider, and this is Shower Gel and Body Lotion Duo. And then I also bought her, this is called Asquith and Somerset, and it is from um, England. And in that, you get, it shows you somewhere what you get. Maybe it's on the bottom. Uh, where did it show you? I know it shows you what you get in here. Oh, there it is. There is a picture on the bottom. <laughs> in this set, you get, um, it looks like a, it's hard to see it, I know. There we go. It looks like you get two bottles of lotion and some hand gel or maybe or uh, maybe get a shower gel. See, it says bubble bath. Bubble, bubble bath body cream and bath salts. So not at all what I said at first, <laughs> if I would just read. And then I thought this was really cool. This is a simple, trendy, modern touch. And it is DIY bath bombs and spa set. So Christina... Um, really likes like the lush bath bombs and but she's also very creative so I thought she would enjoy making her own bath bombs and her own scents and she and Amelia and Gavin could sit there and do that together and make their own scents and I just thought it would be really cool I have no idea how well this set works I hope it I hope it turns out okay uh, and then I bought her this um, this reusable cup it says mom life I just thought that was cute. And then we bought her a 12 Days of Socks. So just because it's a countdown to Christmas, 12 Days of Socks does not mean that they can't have it for Christmas because you could start it in January if you wanted. Uh, but uh, there's crew socks, ankle socks, quarter socks. There's all different kinds of socks in here, but you have no idea what they're gonna be till you open them. And then um, I bought two of these um, uh, these are the OGX. She likes OGX. So I bought her two shampoos and two conditioners of that. And then this is a shampoo and conditioner of the uh, Hugs, which I think it smells really, really good. Um, so I bought her a shampoo and conditioner of that. She, she uh, will use that. And then a long time ago, she had talked about um, doing one of her bathrooms in a, like a beach a beachy type theme and so I saw this uh, wreath and I thought oh well that would go great in a bathroom with a beach theme so we got her that and before I forget to mention it this rug this is a thresh threshold kitchen rug uh, that all this stuff is sitting on so we'll give her that um, I got her this uh, Big Stocking Cocoa Company. Happy Holidays. This is sweet chocolate cocoa mix, salted caramel, and gingerbread. And I could have put that in her stocking, but her stocking's going to have a lot in it. And then I got her this uh, Harry Potter plush blanket. Uh, this It has Hogwarts on it, and they like Harry Potter. And then we thought this was going to be her big gift. It turned out that it wasn't her big gift. We got her something else that was bigger. Uh, but this is a KitchenAid, and it is a full-size regular KitchenAid, and that is the color of it. And... Uh, uh, we got that early on in the year and I've had it hiding out in the attic for her and like I said we thought that was going to be her big gift but it wasn't so the last thing you'll see in this video is um, her big Christine, Christina's big gift 
So starting, I think last year, maybe the year before, I started giving Christina some things that I thought were pricier, uh, but that were also very, very useful uh, that would help her out throughout the year. So um, I started uh, saving like these uh, containers of, um, these are uh, detergent for your clothes. And uh, these are the ones, the, the flings, that uh, the gang flings and the Tide. Uh, so I know the Tides are normally probably uh, $20 a piece. And I'm not a couponer, so I don't get them free like some couponers do. I actually pay full price. Um, but I've collected the Gain Original an Island Fresh and a Moonlight Breeze. And then I have a Tide Spring Meadow and an Ultra Oxy uh, Tide. And then Gain, I thought, you know, who doesn't want um, a dish soap? This is just regular dish soap. I got the Original, the Tropical Sunrise, the Honeyberry Hula Scent, and the lemon zest. And the reason I bought all four is because I thought, well, that's a good time to try them. And she didn't have to buy them herself. And then she, if she really likes one more than the other, then she'll know which one to buy again. I also got her this bounty two package of napkins. So there's two packages. Um, uh, I think there's 200 in each package, I believe. Um, we also bought her some Angel Soft toilet paper and some Sharma, Charmin uh, Mega Rolls of toilet paper. Probably should have bought more toilet paper, but I just didn't. Um, and then this is a complete just um, extravagance. This is something that I do not buy for myself um, because they're not needed. So these are the Downy Unstoppables and you put them in your laundry just for the scent because they really do. We did a video of these a long time ago. They really, really do stay on your clothes for, for weeks after you wash them. Uh, so you can wash with the detergent and that's plenty. That's what we use for uh, Kevin and I to get stains and all that out of clothes. But just to make them smell good, uh, this is like I said, an extravagance. So I bought her the Tide Original, the Fresh, the Bounce, the Old Spice, which I think sounds really neat, and the Spring. So I just think it'll be cool for her to get to use those and see which scent of those uh, she likes the most. And then I've got her uh, two boxes of Kleenex here. These are the uh, Puffs Plus Lotion. That's our favorite kind. Um, I have one of these Febreze. This is Air Wood. Uh, it's Amber is the uh, scent. And it, it did come in a two-pack, and I kept one for Kevin and I, and I'm giving her the other one. And so, uh, this one has not been used. And then lastly, I have been collecting wipes. So, I'm sure you all have noticed, if you watch my grocery hauls at all, that during the grocery hauls, every week, you see wipes. Well, that's because they're not uh, just for me. I've been collecting them for Christina as well. So, this is a three-pack of Clorox Disinfecting Wipes. And then I'm also giving her, this is a great value. Uh, this is the lemon, I guess. Yeah, lemon scent. This is a fresh scent. Another fresh scent. And then uh, this is the uh, crisp lemon in the uh, Clorox. Like, what is in that? So, uh, she'll be getting all these things. And I know she'll be happy because they're useful. One of Christina's big gifts is this uh, Bush Furniture. It's called Bush Furniture Salinas Hall Tree with Storage Bench. And um, it is the Cape Cod Gray. And the reason I'm showing it to you on the computer is because the box, I will show you the box, how it came in the mail. It is just a plain box. So what we did was we printed out a picture of the hall tree to tape to the box so that she will even know what it is because she'll open it up and it's going to be like this plain box and she'll be like, what is, what is inside here? What is, you know, what is it supposed to look like? So I really like this, um, uh, because it has the storage in the bottom and the color um, it came in different colors, but I like this color because it will go uh, with the other things in their house. So I'll show you the box now. 
So this is the box. Like I said, it's a very plain box. It says uh, Bush Furniture on it. It does say shoe, bench, and hall tree. However, um, it, there's no picture on it at all. So this is the picture that we printed off and I'm just going to, like I said, uh, with some box tape, I'll tape that picture on there so that she will know what she's opening. And hopefully there's a picture like like uh, I'm assuming with the directions because you have to assemble it, you'll get a picture on that. But just in case there's no picture for some reason, um, then they'll have this picture.